Good, Ewa Shabbos. I hope you and your family are well. Put your fingers in your ears, but not yet, because I want you to hear the message from this week's tour portion of Pinchas. So we have the final counting of the Jewish people um, before they enter the land of Israel. We have the names of the families which are mentioned. Now, um, there are a number of anomalies compared to the early, earlier mentioning of the families. For example, Rashi points out in this week's Sedra, uh, the fam one of the families of the God family, um, it's called the Osni family, but earlier on they're called the Etzbon family. And Rashi says, well, I don't know why the, there's a change of the name. So what are the name changes? The word Osni is from the word Ozen, which is ear. And the word Etzbon is from the word Etzba, which is a finger. And Rashi says, I don't know what, why we have this change of the names. So there's a Gemara in Kasubas which says as follows. We'll ask the question, why is it that our fingers are shaped, um, tapered off? And so the Gemara answers in order that if we're gonna, if there's a negative um, noise, negative language which has been used around us, negative speech, we can take our etzbon, our etzba, our, our finger, and it fits perfectly into our ears, and we can block off the negativity. And this is one of the skills of life we have on, on our face um, is our gateway to the world, what we see, um, what goes into our mouth, what we speak about, um, and also into our ears as well, what, what we are, information we are taking in. And sometimes we have to be discerning when to um, block that negativity out and we're not listening to those things. That, all these things affect us. So the, the, the idea is to take our finger, the etzbon, etzba, and put it into our osni, the ozen, the ear, and to block out negativity. May Hashem bless us to be able to discern and be able to use our faculties when necessary to block out the negativity, to block out the things which will harm our soul. May we going to Shabbos with a sense of joy and that sense of positivity. Wishing you and your family a good Shabbos.